let's explore our universe. Let's look at our solar system. We will get to know about new facts and new information about our solar system. A solar system is a gravitational bond between the sun and the objects that orbit it, either directly or indirectly. Of the objects that orbit it directly, the largest are the eight planets, and remainder being the smaller objects, dwarf planets, and other solar system bodies. The eight planets include Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. While well, some of the dwarf planets are Pluto, Eris, Makemake, and Haumea. Thank you. The lunar phase or the moon phase is the shape of the directly sunlit portion of the moon viewed from Earth. The lunar phases gradually change over the period of synodic month as the orbital position of the moon around the Earth and the Earth around the sun shift. There are four principal lunar phases, new moon, first quarter, full moon and last quarter. Hello, my name is Tanish and today me, uh, Rahul, Shripad and me are going to talk about how the aliens look in different planets. Come on, let's explore with Rahul and Shripad how they look. This is a fire alien from the lava planet of Surtur. Oh my god, he's starting to get angry. Run for your lives! This guy is a stormtrooper from the first order in Star Wars. Whoa. This guy sure loves dancing. This alien is from the planet Pandora and its name is Delta. It eats only mud and wood and its horns are strong, 100 times stronger than any normal bull. This, this is an ali alien called Xeno. It is from a planet called Violet. It feeds on extraterrestrial objects which helps it get its color and glide upon in the space. This is an alien from out, outer space. She is from the planet called Morato. She feeds on substances like zinc and she is one of the main aliens of the planet. Hey guys, so this is Earth. It consists of 70% of water and 30% of land. Although there's so much water on Earth, all the water is not potable because it's saline. We find fresh water in rivers and lakes. It completes one rotation in 24 hours and completes one revolution around the sun in 365 days. Thank you.